Colburn. I am the instructional coach here at Trist Middle. I welcome you this evening to the eighth grade ceremony. At this time, if you could please remain standing as Maya Cruz and Jeremiah Batto lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by the national anthem and the invocation. science teacher. At this time, I would like to have Trinity Vaughn and Maylene Shipley please come to the stage and introduce the rest of the faculty in the audience. I would 
like to recognize our teachers who are here and who are back at school. Mr. Black, Ms. Priscilla, Ms. Blackwell, Mr. Braddock, Mr. Bradley, Mr. Caserta, Ms. Constanza, Ms. Daly, Ms. Damon, and Coach DeHardy. And Ms. Gagwa, Ms. Gonzalez, Mr. Lambert, Ms. Larson, Mr. Lindo, Ms. Elking, Coach Pan, Mr. Pritchard, Ms. Ramondo, Coach Rhodes, Ms. Sensibi, and Ms. Simpson. Thank you, Charity and Marilyn. At this time, I would like to introduce to the podium Ms. Denise Pritchard, our principal, as she shares some words with our students and guests. So middle school parents out there, I remember how you felt this day. Y'all all can go, <sighs> they almost made it. Just a few more minutes, about an hour, and they'll have made it through middle school. So once again, welcome to our Trist Middle School 2018-2019 eighth grade recognition ceremony. First, to the family members who are present in this venue and to those who could not be here today because we know there's a lot more family members out there who have supported our eighth graders. Thank you for all you've done to support them and everything you've done to support our school. We truly appreciate it. I'd also like to once again thank the faculty and staff. They remain dedicated to our students and we are always appreciative of them. To the school board members and our honored guests, Another note of appreciation for your commitment to education and for being here today. Kara Colburn, our instructional coach, she is also in charge of organizing this event. It's a huge task, and I'd like to say job well done. Good job. Yes. <laughs> to the CHS Tech Department, Mr. Charles Cassar and Fred Bear, they're not here today, but they went they went above and beyond in securing this venue and setting it up for us. I also like to, would like to thank the parish government and the Civic Center employees for, for, for providing and preparing this beautiful building. Thank you. Um, our school has kind of outgrown us, so we appreciate the fact that we can have it here in this lovely venue. Um, all of our students who are here today, I hope that you recognize how many people help to get you here. Every morning, pushing you out of the, your house, making sure you have everything you need um, to getting you here today. So I'm going to ask our eighth graders to give a round of applause to your family and teachers. And now to our eighth graders. You are the real guest of honor here today, and I want to congratulate you. Today, you come to the end of one part of your journey and are right now on course for the beginning of a much larger journey. High school is full of amazing opportunities, but you, only you, as soon to be freshmen, take that in, soon to be freshmen, you will be responsible for taking those opportunities and transforming them into meaningful experiences for yourselves. As you dream up the next four years, I want you to promise yourself right now that you will dream big. Promise all of your supporters here in this building and those who are not here that you will have the courage and confidence to take yourself seriously. You have learned much in middle school. You know how to read closely and think critically and debate ideas. You know how to grapple with challenging mathematical concepts and how to broaden one another's understanding. You know how to test a hypothesis in science and have learned much about your world in social studies. You have danced, you have sang, you have won tournaments, you have won championships, you've had fun. Use what you have gained from middle school to your advantage, and again, promise me to take yourselves seriously. I've lost my... One of the things I want to remind you is that some of you are very young. You're all teenagers. 
But when you go into high school, remember that those days will pass by quickly. Do you remember the first day you walked into middle school? Do you remember it seemed like it was going to be forever? Believe it or not, when you're in high school, you want to go, you're going to want to come back to middle school. You're going to want to visit us. You're going to appreciate what you had. And we want to welcome you. And when you come to see us in the future, we want to hear about all of your experiences. So once again, I want to say congratulations. I want to say thank you. And I want to say dream big. OK. Ms. Pritchard. At this time, I would like to welcome Ms. Abigail Coker. She was our Student of the Year for TRIST. She uh, also was the Parish District winner Student of the Year, and she represented us very, very well at regionals. So, Abigail. parents, family members, friends, and the graduating 8th grade class of 2019. It is an honor to be able to stand here today in front of you all and be able to speak for our class as a whole. We were one of the first classes at Trist to be able to experience school differently with new fields, Chromebooks in every classroom, the construction of a new wing, a new courtyard, and multiple other changes that took time to get used to. We walked into middle school being afraid of forgetting locker combinations, are being sent to Ms. Demers' office. Now, all we're afraid of is another one of Mr. Lindo's lame jokes. <laughs> but along the way, we learned, both academically and socially, how to grow into the people we are today. Martin Luther King Jr. once said, if you can't fly, then run. If you can't run, then walk. If you can't walk, then crawl. But by all means, keep moving. We kept moving. At one point, we did not understand how to move ourselves to become individuals in life. But now that we are beginning to find our way in the world, we will continue to grow. To our staff and teachers, thank you for getting us here. Standing here and reminiscing about everything that happened in middle school makes me think back on all the good times. I think about Ms. Collado hitting the dab in the middle of an English class, or Ms. Demers playing Pictionary with us when we're supposed to be working. The fondest memory I have, however, is spending my sixth grade social studies class outside and laughing as Ms. Smith criticized us for our bad acting skills. For two years, I had Ms. Smith as a social studies teacher. The thing I remember most about her is that she taught me beyond just what I needed to know to pass tests. She truly embodies what a teacher at Trist is. They always took the time to be able to help their students understand the curriculum and how the world works, making us better people in society. Thank you all for growing our knowledge, both in the classroom and in the real world. Thank you to our parents, guardians, family members, and friends who have also helped on this journey. Without you, we wouldn't have been able to get an education. You've put up with our constant complaining, procrastination, and neediness for the last three years. But I'm sure that you will probably deal with it for the rest of our school careers and into our adult lives. You are the ones guiding us toward our futures in the real world. You are the ones helping us figure out if we're supposed to run, fly, walk, or even crawl through each and every trial and tribulation, through each experience, good or bad. You are our role models and our rocks, and we are internally thankful for your guidance, support, and love. Finally, to my peers, don't stop your progress. We've already learned the basics. It just gets harder from here. But we are able to dream bigger and work harder than anyone else if we just keep going. High school will be a new journey as we are experiencing new things for the first time. Some of us may have crawled to make it here, but maybe Trist Middle School has taught us more about ourselves than we thought. Maybe, just maybe, we are now able to fly to new heights and grow into even more amazing people. So take these past three years and hold them dear to your heart because the next time we will walk across the stage and think about our past school experiences, will be as the graduating seniors of the class of 2023. It's an exciting thought, really, and I can't wait to see what the next four years will bring to us all. Thank you. Great job, Abigail. At this time, I'd like to welcome Felicity White, our, one of our eighth grade students, 
uh, accompanied by Mr. Doug Black, our social studies teacher, as they perform The Climb by Molly, Molly Cyrus. I can almost see it, that dream I'm dreaming, but there's a voice inside my head saying, you'll never reach it. Every step I'm taking, every move I make feels lost with no direction. My faith is shaking, but I gotta keep trying, gotta keep my head held high. There's always gonna be another mountain. I'm always gonna. struggles I'm facing, the chances I'm taking, sometimes they knock me down, but no, I'm not breaking, I may not know it, but these are the moments I'm gonna remember most, just gotta keep going, and I gotta be strong. Pushing on. There's always gonna be another mountain. I'm always gonna wanna make it move. Always gonna be an uphill battle. Sometimes you're gonna have to lose. Ain't about how fast I get there. Ain't about what's waiting on the other side. into the light you can deter yourself from sneezing crying and I was fine until I looked over to Miss Capstick <laughs> <laughs> I think that this is probably one of the most talented classes we've ever had here at Tris between the national anthem and Felicity that was beautiful thank you Mr. Black that was his idea so thank you okay at this time we're going to go ahead and present some awards we're going to start with the perfect attendance. Okay, earlier today we gave out nine weeks, nine weeks awards, so we're going to start with all year and three year awards. Okay, at this time, perfect attendance, we need Amado Amador, Junior, all year. This is perfect attendance all year. Chance Barnett, Silas Barnett, Olivia Brazil. Rhea Espiritu, Bryn Plesha, David Vu, and Katherine Wilson. Perfect attendance for three years. So we have three students who have had perfect attendance all three years, sixth, seventh, and eighth grade. And that is Marissa Garrett, Marissa Garrett, Bryn Plesha, and Katherine Wilson.
Okay, we now have honor roll. This is honor roll, honor roll medal all year. Emma Abadie, Ty Abadie, Peyton Adams, Blaith Ahmed, Sanaya Isola, Amado Amador, Shay Beckham, Autumn Blackmore, Austin Booz, Brandon Bourgeois, Brianna Brown, Ayla Calluet, Neil Cantor, Vincent Carlos, Audrey Cox, Maya Cruz, Jake Devonport, Gavin Diaz, Sarah Dodd, Hayden Edwards, Kiner Isolo, Teresa Grafato, Trenton Grimion, Ryan Guerra, Alana Holmes, Najiha Kahala, Landon Lemoyne, Makaya Maharang, Anthony Morello, Jasmine Murray, Coy Wynn, Kim Wynn, Lily Wynn, Emma Packett, Alexa Plumstead, Sasha Quintanella, Brennan Schmidt, Shelby Schneider, Alexis Smith, Todd Steckman, Carmen Tonnery, Aubrey Toops, Kai Williams, and Nicholas Woodson. Honor roll all year. And just to let you know, that's A's and B's, no C's anywhere on their report card, not even in PE, electives, or conduct. Our next award is honor roll three years, and you receive a trophy. Emma Abadie, Peyton Adams, Sanaya Isola, Shay Beckham, Austin Booz, Brandon Bourgeois, Ayla Calluet, Maya Cruz, Jake Devonport, Hayden Edwards, Rhea Espiritu, Trenton Bremion, Alana Holmes, Landon Lemoyne, Makayla Maharang, Koi Wynn, Lily Wynn, Na Fan, Alexa Plumstead, Noah Sheeler, Brennan Schmidt, Shelby Schneider, Alexis Smith, Todd Steckman, Aubrey Toots, Felicity White, Katherine Wilson, Nicholas Woodson. That is on roll, A's and B's, no C's anywhere on the report card for all three years. Next award is Honor Roll Principals List All Year. So that means a 4.0, straight A's. And electives, content area courses, and conduct. So for all year, we have Abigail Coker, Rhea Espiritu, Anna Wynn, Logan Wynn, Na Fan, Noah Sheeler, David Wu, Felicity White, and Katherine Wilson. Congratulations. And we have two students of the ones I just called who received the principal's honor roll, all A's, everywhere on the report card, all three years, sixth, seventh, and eighth grade, 
and that is for three years Abigail Coker and David Vu. Congratulations. Early today, we did recognize some, some of our four nine weeks awards. So at this time, if you received a certificate or a medal, please go ahead and stand. These are either for content or the fourth nine weeks, whether it be most improved, best effort, outstanding, or honorable, perfect attendance. All of these students received an award. So can we give them a round of applause, please? Okay, I may have a seat. Okay, at this time I would like to call Ria Espiritu to receive the National Ac Academic Games Award for one year. She represented us. She represented us at, at nationals in Orlando, Florida, and it was third place, third place in propaganda, and seventh place in presidents. Congratulations. I'm oh, sorry. I, I jumped ahead of myself, so I do need to recognize individuals. When I call out each award that you received, if you received it, you may stand. Sorry about that. Perfect attendance, fourth nine weeks. Let's go ahead and do that. Perfect attendance, fourth nine weeks. If you received perfect attendance, fourth nine weeks, go ahead and stand. Very good. Certificate of congratulations. Okay, you may be seated. Certificate of achievement. You can stand up. Tyrese, Zoe, Jasmine, Chris, no, just sit right here. Bren, there you go. Okay, congratulations. Jasmine, there you go. Okay, Merit Honor Roll, fourth nine weeks. A's and B's on your report card. Merit Honor Roll. Very good. Okay, Scholar Honor Roll. Honor roll, fourth nine weeks. It's all the age. And then if you received a medal for English, math, science, social studies, journeys, and physical education, go ahead and stand up. Congratulations. And parents, you'll be receiving a mail out with a report card in there, many of our students received the Patrick Taylor Award. It will be in the envelope. So please make sure you do not overlook that because it'll be some fun things for you to do uh, as a family over the summer. So for the zoo, the aquarium, the insectarium. So look for those. Okay, at this time, we would like to recognize the perfect pirate all year. If you can come on down. This is perfect pirate, no infractions, no write-ups for all year. Emma Abadie, Peyton Adams, Laith Ahmad, Amado Amador, Shay Beckham, Alex Blanchard, Allison Boy, Sean Bruce, Ayla Caluet, Vincent Carlos, Abigail Coker, Audrey Cox, Maya Cruz, Daryl Dennis, Rhea Espiritu, Jocelyn Furman, Marissa Garrick, Anna Marie Gonzalez, Teresa Grafato, Trenton Grimion, Najiha Kahala, Madeline Plexif, Tamia Lee, and 
Sasha Quintanella, Sky Rudisil, Madison Samajay, Noah Sheeler, Mayling Shipley, Alexis Smith, Todd Steckman, Christopher Tinarella, Carmen Tonnery, Trinity Vaughn, David Vu, Janae Wheat, Felicity White, and Katherine Wilson. Congratulations. We have 14 students who received Perfect Pirate all three years while they were at Trist. That means no write-ups all three years, 6th, 7th, and 8th grade. Emma Abadie, Peyton Adams, Abigail Coker, Maya Cruz, Rhea Espiritu, Jocelyn Furman, Trenton Grimion, Michaela Maharong, Na Fan, Sasha Quintanella, Noah Sheeler, Todd Steckman, David Wu, and Katherine Wilson. Congratulations. <laughs> Abigail. And we would like to recognize would like to recognize Abigail Coker as our student of the year for Trist and our district. Okay, at this time, it is time for the eighth grade students to receive their certificates and their medals. Inspirational hero, and that goes to Bryn Flesher. So, Bryn is a cheerleader. She's on honor roll. She's on the swim team. She helps me sometimes. <laughs> Keeps me on track, Un unlike just now, because I've, I almost let it slip. But congratulations, Bren. Okay, at this time, we'd like to have our eighth grade students get ready to receive their certificates and medals. Congratulate them as they move into their next, on their next path in this journey, and that is high school. So it's one last chance for our eighth graders, Miss Emma Abadie. Ty Abadie. Lexton Abdu. Peyton Adams. Laith Ahmed, Sanaya Asola, Olivia Alfonso, 
Russo. Sean Allison. Amado Amador Jr. Laura Amorum. Jade Anderson. Jeffrey Andrews. Kyron Angeletti. Keith Araby. Gabrielle Adler. Christian Ayala. Rael Banks. Chance Barnett. Silas Barnett. Jemiah Bartholomew. Jeremiah Batto. Shay Beckham. Sophia Bevins. Christopher Bianami. Autumn Blackmore. Anaria Blaze. Alex Blanchard. Austin Booz. Brandon Bourgeois. Davielle Bowman. Kelian Boyd. Allison Boyd. Lillian Boyington. Tyrese Brady. Olivia Brazil. Ava Britton. Brianna Brown. Keldon Brown. Cole Brown. Sean Bruce. Ayla Caluet. Kayla Calise, Colin Cangelosi, Neil Cantor, Vincent Carlos, Kayla Case, Hazlyn Casey Spencer, Desmond Shambliss, Denasia Shortain, Caleb Chapetta. Chalette, Raylan Clark, Alea Clay, Abigail Coker, Deuce Cook, Audrey Cox, Maya Cruz, Anthony Dana, Michael Detallo Jr. Cade DeSell, Jake Devonport, Gavin Diaz, Joel Dysadu, Sarah Dodd, Samaj Douglas, Wesley Duplessis, Marcel Duran, Alan Duvio Jr., Hayden Edwards, Connor Iserlow, Cameron Ellison, Brandon Ancolade Jr., Rhea Espiritu, Adriana Eugene, Jocelyn Furman, Akaya Fields, Destiny Jode, Marissa Garrett. Anna Marie Gonzalez, Nathaniel Gonzalez, Sophia Gonzalez, Corey Gordon, Elena Gould, Teresa Grafado, Trenton, Trenton Grimion, Ryan Guerra, Julianne Guerrero, Wendell Hampton.
Christian Armani Harris, Dijon Harvey, Devon Harvey, Armani Haynes, Griffin Hayes. Alana Holmes, Kira Raven Hood, Janari Cooper, Malaysia Johnson, Savannah Jala, Nathan Jones, Najiha Kahala, Bryce Kaufman, Madison, Madeline Flagseth, Jenna. Lobure, Aubrey Lane, Zoe Langley, Taylor LaBeouf, Tamia Lee. Stephen Lejean Jr. Landon Lemoyne. Miguel Leon. Nicholas Lewis. Wayson Lynn. Miracle Littles. Kyla Maharin, Bryla Major, Tyrone Major, Michael Martin Jr., Mauricio Matute, Ariel McBride, Colton McCormick. Andrew Moiti Jr. Laney Monteleone. Anthony Morello. Alasia Mosley. Joseph Mosley. Leslie Mosley. Chelsea Murphy. Jasmine Murray. Charles Nellig, Karon Netter, Anna Wynn, Coy Wynn, Kim Wynn, Lily Wynn, Logan Wynn, Matthew Nunez, Destiny Ostendorf, Emma Packett, Frank Padilla III, Mercedes Panagua, Jesse Patty, Ariel Hall, Justin Pazimas, Na Fan, Jaden Pittman, Alexa, Alexa Plumstead, Colin Potter, Sasha Quintanella, Alexia Ramirez, Jasmine Ramos, Rochelle Richardson. Ali Reggio, Julio Rivas, Anaya Rodney, Jace Rokes, Janaea Rotunda, Gabrielle Roussel, Sky Rudisil, 
Destiny Rupel, Kelsey Rupel, Madison Samajay, Yusra Samoa, Patience San Miguel, Cornell Santa Cruz Jr., Tasaya Santa Cruz. Noah Sheeler, Colby Scheffler, Brennan Schmidt, Shelby Schneider, Olivia Seeley, Mayling Shipley, Duet Sims IV, Alexis Smith, Todd Steckman, Diamond Sill. Naria Sylvester, Navea Tate, Dylan Taylor, Fane Tenario Perez, Niel Thompson, Nicholas Vaughn Jr., Christopher Tenorella. Dominic Perez, Aubrey Toops, Micah Tran, Bryson Truitt, Victoria Umanzer, Trinity Vaughn. Nareda Vizcaya, David Vu, Hanson Vu, Johnny Wall, Gabriel Watson, Janaya Wheat, Amaya Whitby, Felicity. White, Ian Williams, Kai Williams, Catherine Wilson, Nicholas Woodson. a round of applause for you. Okay, this time I would like for Randon Bourgeois to please come up on stage so he can lead us in the benediction. stand for the benediction and bow your head. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for bringing us here together today. Please guide us as we leave middle school and continue our journey into high school. Watch over us and our loved ones as we move on through life. In his name we pray, amen. amen. storyteller and then that is eighth grade students you have brains in your head you have feet on your shoes you can steer yourself in any direction you choose dr. Seuss parents 
They're yours. Congratulations.